It was meant for me to come outside today because this beautiful weather. Look at the sun. Look at this on the skin. You know what's up. What's up? What's up? What's up? Um, today we're doing a little vloggy vlog. Um, I just woke up maybe like 30 minutes ago. I walked the dogs and now I'm about to feed them. Um, I was going to get back in bed, but one of my dogs is having serious life problems. So it's kind of stressing me out. So I just stayed up. But yeah, um, he's pestering me. Where is he? Onyx. This one is pestering me to feed him. And then that one is the dog with the issues. So, let's feed them. I am plan on making a smoothie. You hear him? Smoothie for breakfast, maybe some biscuits and some vegan eggs. But, we have plans today. We're going outside today. But let's go ahead and feed them so he can stop being a nuisance. We can take it slow. Stay up to the morning. We're just taking this moment. And my dogs are really uh, bougie. They eat raw food. Um, I put a lot of stuff on it. Cinnamon has a lot of um, supplements that she has to have on her food because she has like bladder issues because she was spayed so young. She has allergies right now. She has like a respiratory. It's just, it's too much. So I get her a lot of like um, natural alternatives for these things because I'm very health, you know, um, I don't know the word I'm looking for, but because she has so many allergies and stuff, I don't want anything to trigger anything. So I try to get the best possible options for her. So no synthetic dyes or artificial flavors or nothing like that. She gets the best. Um, but yeah, let me get back with you guys for a second and then I'll let you know what we're doing today. Cause All right, so I'm just going to start doing my makeup for today before I do like the blender and making a bunch of noise. My boyfriend, he's still asleep. I said he can sleep in today even though it was his turn to walk the dogs because I'm off. But... We're going to be quiet for now. Do my makeup. Um, so for today's plans, um, I want to go thrifting. I want to go to at least two different thrift stores, depending on how much I find from the one. And then he wants to go to H&M. And I'm going to take the opportunity to take some IG pics. Probably try like the parking garage type scenario see how that goes so you guys gotta help well you can't help me but i'll show you guys some outfits i'm not sure exactly what i want to wear but um yeah so thrifting h&m take my ig pics and um i need to pick up my car because the heat was not working for like a day so my mom took it to go get it fixed so I have to pick up my car and I need to go to PetSmart or Petco to pick up 
for some med medicine for cinnamon. And then probably go to like Walmart or Target or something because we need stuff for the house. So yeah, we got errands to run. Um, I don't know what we're going to eat. But eating needs to be in the equation. Um, so yeah, but we're just going to do my makeup real quick. And I also want to show you guys these magnetic lashes. I got off Amazon. I know the Glamnetic ones. They're they seem really nice, but they are really well. They're not really expensive, but they're a little on the expensive side. So I was like, let me find a dupe somewhere because I want to try them. Like I like lashes, but like applying them with actual lash glue and then the strip and it, it's just too much and, and they don't stay on. And then I tried the um, the individual ones, and those were cute. The only thing is I kept losing them here and there after I was sleeping. So, I don't know. I probably would try those again. But if these work out really good, then this is all I have to use. I got the 10 pack, the 10 pairs, and it comes with two tubes of eyeliner and... Um, and they're reusable so that was a steal right it was like $26 for 10 pairs and two things it was a deal so that's what we went with but yeah um I have some ideas for my next two styling videos and they both are going to be featuring um the thrifting so I'm pretty excited about it. I already have like some looks that I'm kind of basing it off of. So I have particular things that I need to find. So I'm not just going to be willy nilly thrifting for anything. So that is good for me. Um, and I don't know if I want to set a budget for myself or not. But we'll see. And we're doing a full face today. Um, I feel like I haven't done a full face in a while. So yeah. Where is my and I did my hair last night. It turned out actually really cute, surprisingly. I only had like a handful of hair and I kinda cut it in half and split it and kinda used it, you know, um, in the best way I could without running out of pieces in the front I didn't put hair there because I ran out also it's in the front I left it for that reason just in case so I can twist and it'll still look kind of cute what am I looking for I can't multitask very well so um yeah just get into this makeup real quick and then um I'll talk to you guys again once we start cooking and making a bunch of noise. Just take care. 
touches this lip gloss I found this lip gloss after not having it for like maybe two years I got this in an ipsy little bag when I used to do shh, ipsy and I love this little lip gloss like I used to wear it all the time I'm surprised it has any in there but I need to go find it it's like trust fund beauty and it's beautiful like it has a little bit of pigment but it's super glossy and lightweight yes so it looks like I did like a very um a little dark tone neutral look I always this always happens like I need to work on light makeup looks because I always go towards like browns and nudes and golds I just like that and I do very well with it so um, yeah but I have I did buy this palette like for the summertime and I used it a couple of times like it's very bright I'm just not good at these colors there was one makeup look that I did with like blue green and it was so beautiful it was like silvery that one was nice i wish i could go back in time i have pictures though so i'll just relive it through the pictures i don't know if i'll be able to um do it again because sometimes i just be freestyling and something comes up but if i'm not like freestyling and trying something different then this is what i get I'm going to set my face real quick and then we will get into the lashes. Also, um, most of these products I use every day, like everyday makeup. I do have an everyday makeup look on my channel, so um, the link will be in the bio, but definitely check that out. Because I didn't really show you guys what products I use. But if you want to see 
the basics of the basics products that I use, um, it will be in the link in the bio. But um, all of my brushes are from a um, the 50 set elf brush kit. So that's where all my brushes come from. I love elf brushes. I love elf makeup in general. And then um, everything is pretty much drugstore friendly except for the setting powder I use is this brand called Sach Sasha. Yeah, I'm going to say Sacha. Um, I love yellow toned setting powders. I will not use anything else. I don't like the um, medium shades that are in the drugstores. I don't, well I've never tried the translucent one, but I just, I like something that is, matches my skin a little bit better. So that's what we went with. And then this is my hair. Like how I was telling you guys, I just kind of twisted my own hair in the front because I can easily like twist those backs. But the rest of it, I added hair to it just to give it a little bit of length because my hair does um, shrink up when I twist it. And it's really cute and it looks pretty natural. I mean, it's thick at the end and then like the curls are kind of like, they look like weightless curls and it looks really natural and pretty. So... This turned out really well. I did do my parting a lot better than I did um, for just regular twists. And I do have a um, two strand twist video coming up. I believe probably before this vlog comes up, you guys will see my um, two strand twist. But um, let's get into these lashes. And I'm also going to make um, this last tryout on my TikTok, so um, yeah, you guys can have a little bit of behind the scenes for my TikTok video. I'm trying to work on all three of my social medias, you know, to kind of help with YouTube. I just, um, I don't know. I did like a couple of hair videos on TikTok that did so well. But the whole thing is like you have to brand everything how you want it to look. And I kind of re want to rebrand my TikTok. So Halloween I don't party. know. Sorry. Alright, so um, yeah, let's get into the lashes. And um, I'll just show you some behind the scenes. Or you guys can just look with me. Let's turn my brightness up. Let's turn my ring light on. It should have been on. That would have been better lighting, right? Do I need some earrings or something on? I got my, uh, don't mind my t-shirt. Um, I'm not in this, but let's scoot up so you can't really see it, right? Okay, I feel like I need earrings then. Do y'all ever feel like naked or boyish with no like earrings in sometimes? Even if you have full face makeup, whatever. It's just not as cute without the earrings. And I am going to edge control my edges. So they look a little better. I don't have an earring back. But let me just say. <coughs> oh no, I'm looking a little uh, whitewashed. On the um, on the thing. That's better light. Some yellow light. All right. So now I'm gonna be talking to TikTok. So keep watching. Do that behind the scenes, but go follow me on TikTok at India Babes so you can see it. <coughs> Y'all, I am feeling, you don't, you don't even know. You don't even want to know how I'm feeling. Like, look at these lashes. Wait, let me turn on the light. Look at these lashes. 
beautiful. And they were super easy, like liner, put eyelash on, adjust. Anyways, these lashes are beautiful. And they're so easy and they're cheap, way cheaper than the Glamnatic ones and you get so much more. So if you need to cop these, I'm going to put the link in the bio, go check out my TikTok to see the application and everything. And first impressions. Um, I think my boyfriend is up now, so we are going to make my smoothie for the morning. Probably whip up some biscuits and stuff, and then you guys can help me pick out my outfit for today, but this is the makeup look. Alright, so apparently somebody doesn't want biscuits and eggs, so I'm going to just make the smoothies, um, because he's the one who liked them the most the last time, so I'm not going to waste no time and energy um so yeah i'm gonna get my fruits and stuff and you guys can watch me make the smoothies this is my hair for today um i'm in the kitchen so the lighting is kind of in the middle and i'm kind of on the side so i don't look very nice but i'm satisfied with my hair i did my edges somewhat i'm not good at baby hair so don't judge me but yeah, and then we just gotta pick out my outfit. But let's get into this smoothie making. All right, so got some supplements here. Uh, this is seed buckthorn berry oil. Um, it's some kind of healing oil for, I don't know what it's for, the immune system. It says boost immune system and promotes skin health. And then we got some black seed oil. If you don't know about black seed oil, get into it. Um, very good for immunity and a fixer all for everything. I wonder if cinnamon can have some of this. I'm gonna look it up. And then I'm gonna put some flax seed in there, some chia seeds, and I always have um, frozen bananas on hand. Um, I make ice cream and milkshakes with it also. Got some almond milk I'm going to use. Um, some berries in here. And then we got pineapple, or mangoes, and pineapples. So let me wash my hands because I've been touching a bunch of um, products and stuff and I don't want to taste that. I'm gonna drink my smoothie real quick and then um, I'm gonna get dressed. I kind of want to leave out of here by 12 30. It's 11 15. Stay up till the morning. I'm just taking this moment. All right, so now it's time to pick out an outfit. Um, I've been using Pinterest as a guide for like stuff I want to do and like looks. So I think I have. I might do this today because I have similar things if it will adjust. So I have like an off the shoulder top like this. I have a dupe bag like this from Shein. I do have some Air Force ones and I do have some blue whip drip jeans. I don't know. 
I feel like it's very easy and I don't have to do too much. Yeah, I feel like that's how we're feeling today. Or even something like this. High neck, black tee, some flare jeans and a black purse. I could do that too. And that could be really easy. I don't know. But yeah, I'm, it's looking like I'm leaning towards the first one because that's just super easy to pull off, you know? I was going to try to make my own outfits because I do have some options on my rack. But I don't feel like struggling and trying on a bunch of outfits. So I'm going to just do that. So I'm going to pick out the stuff and then I'm going to get dressed, show y'all what it's looking like, and I'll be back. Alright, so this is the fit. This is what we're working with. I kind of mixed both of them together. So I did the long sleeve turtleneck, flare jeans, but with the white shoes and the little dupe purse. I took the little coin part off. But yeah, and then... I'm going to bring these white boots to take pictures in for IG. I'm going to do it in these shoes but also with the boots because I love these and I really wanted to style them. So this is what we're looking like. So that was super easy. Like I need to use Pinterest more often because this is cute. And then I'm just going to keep my hair like this, put on some lip gloss, and because this is like this detail, I'm not going to put any jewelry on, maybe some bangles to accessorize a little bit, but that's about it. So, um, I don't want my batteries to die, my other two are currently charging, I'm going to take them and let them charge in the car, but I'll get with you guys when we get to our destination. Alright, so we are at... Uh, this little outdoor mall thing to go to H&M. in the background but I got a burrito whatever this sauce is on the side I got iced tea it's called Qdoba I think yeah I've never had it before so we're gonna see I did get the impossible meat I probably could have went without but it's fine kind of smells funky Can you smell it So I just finished eating. Hopefully there's not food on my face. If so, excuse me. Um, this is, ah, oh, that music is so loud. I might be just talking for no reason because I might have to block it out if there is music playing, but the food was okay. The, the flavor was there, but the quality of the food wasn't there. It wasn't very fresh, I don't know. But um, I think we're done in here. Probably gonna go find me a parking lot to take some pictures and go on to what I'm doing for the day. Jabria, are you smart? Yes! What is a QR code?
was meant for me to come outside today because this beautiful weather. Look at this sun. Look at this on the skin. Yes, that is what we want for today. Uh, we're done shopping now. I didn't get anything, surprisingly. There were opportunities, but I did not get anything. Um, that burrito is not going to agree with me at all, I'm pretty sure. It's just, it's leaving me with this strange feeling of discomfort. Like my stomach's not hurting or gurgling or anything, but it's just uncomfortable. It's like, doesn't feel normal. But yes, skin, let me... We're here at the thrift store now. I didn't realize it was so close. Let's see how this goes. I haven't gone thrifting in years. Maybe like three years. But I have particular things that I need to get, so I feel like I should get a cart. I don't know. Let me go find one. All right, so I got a cart. I'm gonna go on my, I made a Pinterest board to figure out the stuff that I need. We're gonna start with my first look, which is this. So let's do it. So I was so worried about my battery dying. But I did not bring a second memory card. Well, I could delete some stuff off my camera real quick. That's a good idea. Hold on. All the stuff I recorded recently, I need. So I can't delete the stuff off my camera. Um, but I have found a couple of things. I, the red shirt that I told you guys I was looking for, I have not found anything like it. I could probably find something and then like crop it myself but it's not looking too good but I can show you guys what I have so far but let me go through this section and then I'll show you guys what I have all right so I think I'm about done here I'm not gonna show you guys the way that it's cropped it I got these on sale. These are Levi's, I think. Levi's, yeah, they're either mid-rise skinny jeans in a size 8. I got these, like, stretch tech ones. They have a variety tail on the back and the front, and these are a size medium. They're $5. I got this sweater. It has these things on it, though. I'm gonna take these off, because these are cute. I got this sweater. It has, like, this detail. And it also has these things. These will probably be taken off. And then this is the closest find to that red shirt I was looking for. I'll just crop it and see how it does. This is just a cute sweater that I want. And this is a cute little nice material. It looks very, very new. So I want to go to one other place because I didn't find a lot of stuff on my board that I was looking for. So. I'll see you guys when we get there. This has a much bigger selection. I'm really looking for tote bags, but I guess that's not a thing. I used to be able to find a bunch of bags in thrift stores, but not no mo. All right, so we're in the second one. Um, this one is a lot less organized and there's a lot of people in here, but it's Monday and they have a sign that says 25% off all merchandise Mondays only. Today is Monday. So it's busy in here. I found one thing so far, but it's not on my Pinterest board which I'm looking for certain things. I'm looking for some sweater vests and 
flannels in here for sure um this is one thing i have this is cute it's cropped you know this is cute this is 2.99 and i'm guessing 25 percent off of that so we'll see hopefully this music is very unclear in the back and it won't copyright me we'll see all right like i said i've reached my quota um i didn't find a lot of the things on my pinterest board they're just not here you know couldn't find no flannels no sweater vest that's a tripod yeah so um i did get some stuff that i just liked in general but it's a bust all right so i am back home for a brief second we kind of pushed it with the time and we needed to come home and walk the dogs um I still have to go get my car and we still need to go to Walmart or something to get a couple of things for the house. Um, this is the stuff that we came home with. This is only really big because there's like sweaters in there. I only got, actually I got a couple of things last minute. This top I showed you guys. Um, I didn't show you guys these things but I got some sweaters in here also. He got some movies. Yeah, I think he got some movies and a shirt that he's either going to resell or something like that. But, um, um, these clothes are going in the wash before I try them on, anything like that. So that's why we need to go to Walmart so we can get detergent and stuff because I have other clothes in the wash that need to be washed. But yeah, it was a productive day even though i didn't find a lot of the stuff i was looking for i still got some cute stuff so i don't know if i have to like change the video that i was going for or what we're gonna do about that but yeah that's the end of this vlog um that is the end of today's vlog thank you guys so much for tuning in stay tuned for the next videos i don't know um, the order of the videos that I'm going to be doing, but, um, my new upload days are going to be Tuesday and Thursday. So, um, all right. I will see you guys in my next video. Guess where we are? Another thrift store. <laughs> this one is by our house, actually. Um, this is not in the plans.